COVID-19 is a disease caused by the virus SARS-CoV-2. The virus can affect people differently. How may HIV affect your COVID risk? For people living with HIV, the three main risk factors that can increase the risk of serious illness from COVID-19 are a weakened immune system, underlying health conditions, and older age. If you are on HIV treatment with an undetectable viral load and a strong immune system with a CD4 count above 200, you are not expected to be at higher risk of severe illness from COVID-19. However, if you are not on HIV treatment or if you have a low CD4 count, you may be at increased risk of severe illness from COVID-19. Some people living with HIV may have other underlying health conditions that are known to increase the risk of serious illness from COVID-19. The risk of serious illness from COVID-19 also increases for everyone with age, regardless of HIV status. What can you do to protect your health during the COVID-19 pandemic? Stay engaged in healthcare and manage any related health conditions to remain healthy and minimize your risk of serious illness from COVID-19. If you are not on HIV treatment, consider starting treatment as soon as possible. If you are on treatment, ongoing adherence is also important. Take your medications regularly as prescribed. If you are having trouble sticking to your treatment schedule, discuss this with your healthcare provider to help find solutions. Try to stay up to date on vaccinations, including the annual influenza vaccine. Vaccines are good for overall health. Vaccines, including recommended boosters, prevent serious illness, hospitalizations, and death from COVID-19. These are safe and effective in people living with HIV. Check with your local public health unit or talk to your healthcare provider about getting vaccinated and staying updated with boosters. Though COVID-19 hasn't gone away, there are ways you can stay healthy, connect with people, and prevent getting or passing on the virus. It's important to regularly connect with others, especially if you live alone. Try using video or phone calls to stay in touch with family or friends. COVID-19 has been a hard time for many people. If you are feeling depressed or anxious, talk to a healthcare provider about getting support. Check with public health guidelines about when isolation may be necessary. Throughout the COVID-19 pandemic, you may continue to experience some changes to your HIV care. You may have noticed that regular monitoring appointments with your healthcare provider or lab tests may be less frequent. Video and phone calls may have replaced some face-to-face -face appointments with your healthcare team. Despite these changes, it is very important to stay engaged in HIV care. You may also continue seeing some changes to the way your medications are dispensed. Discuss your options with your healthcare provider and your pharmacist to make sure you always have enough medication on hand. For more information, visit kd.ca or consult your local public health unit.